Back sooner okay. than expected. Back sooner than expected. Let's just dive right in. Let's just dive right in. Oh my god, I can't do hard mode. Oh my god, I can't do hard mode. All right. Well, we'll play it on right. easy. Well, we'll play it on and, uh, easy. And uh, I think for the most part it should be a breeze. I think for the most but part it should be a breeze. But do not dream change. sequences. Do not change. Fucking terrible. And they're fucking terrible. Yeah, there might be a yeah. delay, but there might be a delay, but I'm just gonna roll with it and hopefully it'll I'm just roll uh, with it and hopefully it'll correct uh, itself. Correct itself. There isn't an echo. That's not what there you isn't mean, an right? echo. Like an audio delay. That's not what you mean, right? Like an audio delay. I am echoing, aren't I? How I the... am echoing, aren't I? How the... Well, it's not that I'm listening to myself. Well, it's, it's not that I'm listening that... to myself. It's just that it never used to be a problem. It never used to be a problem. Alright, if I do this, though. Alright, if I do this, though. Is there any game audio? Is there any game audio? I don't audio? hear anything in the game now. Because I don't hear anything in the game now. I had this all worked out. I had this what all the... worked out. What the? What the? What the? Oh, 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 oh. Wait. Oh, 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 oh. Wait. Fixed. Yeah? I was still on the force back then. Did I, did I fix it? Midtown North Precinct, Hell's Kitchen. So when are you coming to work for me to take the fame? Oh. You'd make me work undercover in some hell hole. I Sorry, think I did. Michelle and the baby come first. Hello. My last smoke. Hello, you curious fucker. Max, a regular boy scout. See you, Alex. We're still on for poker Thursday night, right? Like taking candy from a baby. And, and you can hear the game audio and all that. Life was good. Sun setting on a sweet summer's day. Smell of freshly mowed lawns. <laughs> sounds of children playing. I don't know. Did it sound like one? River on the Jersey side beautiful wife and a baby girl hello you, you curious fuckers <laughs> no probably not i'm pretty pretty shit at, <laughs> at accents the sun went down with practice bravado mm. twilight crawled across the sky laden with foreboding okay this is my all-time favorite video Show. game honey anybody home Believe it or not. The show started. They give me the best seat in the house, front row center. Colors okay. Good. What the hell? What the hell? Something ugly had been tattooed on the wall. A map of things to come. It was a poison syringe, a magic tag full of diabolical meanings. His jacket, yes. Oh yeah, and something that happened is uh I wanted to play this on my 360, but turns out I don't own the game on 360, so now I gotta play it on PS4. Listen, I'm not used to the controls on PS4, so I'm probably gonna be pretty shitty for a little bit. Yes, someone's broken into my house. They're still here. You have to good. good. I cannot help you. Who is this? So there's gonna be a little trial and error with this one. Getting comfortable with the uh, PlayStation controller for Max Payne. No, I am a I'm a Beretta guy through and through. Michelle! Oh, 
flesh of fallen angels. This game really starts at a 10. Emotionally. Oh, baby. I didn't even realize the game is naturally cropped based on playing on a, a PS4. Huh? No! It was three years ago. Everything ripped apart in the New York Minute. Yes. The killer yes. junkies had been high on a previously unknown designer drug, Val. And we're gonna listen v. to all the. Uh, After the funeral. Watch all the cutscenes and everything. Transferring to the DEA. It took us three long years to get a break in the Valkyrie case. Then finally, two months ago, a dime dropper tipped us off that Jack Lupino, a mob boss in the Punchinello crime family, was trafficking. I went undercover. Infiltrated the worst mafia. Jack Lapino's a nut. A psycho voodoo nutbag. I came in from the cold oh, in the dark. Thought outside we were the play. city was a cruel monster. I've been slowly working my way from the small time to the big fish, trying to get to the source of the drug. Alex and BB were my only contacts in the DEA. The only ones in this decrepit city who knew I was down here. BB here. Something urgent has come up with Jack Lapino. You need to meet with Alex immediately at the Roscoe Street station. I hadn't had a face to face with Alex since I'd gone undercover. He's too deep. Outside, the mercury was falling fast. It was colder than the devil's heart, raining ice pitchforks as if the heavens were ready to fall. Everyone was running for shelter like there was no tomorrow. It didn't get any better when I got to the subway. He's such a poet. The feeling hit me like a point blank shot straight in the face. Something was not right about this. My Beretta stirred nervously under my coat, but the train doors had already shut behind me. And I was in for the ride. Next stop, Roscoe Street Station. Max is a hunk. Alex. Look at that angular face. The station was drenched in gloom. Chiseled was a ghost. The gods the themselves. I have to look for him. Uh oh. Death was in the air at Roscoe Street. I'd have to find Alex fast. Something's rotten here. Shoot first, ask questions later. Some video lag here, but Christ, <laughs> what's the deal? I can't even play a PS2 game from 2001. Come on. Soda, please. Yeah, this game was very defining for my uh <laughs> for my childhood. 
<laughs> I like obsessed with this. Alex Reg, thank you. Kiss it, goodbye. Kiss it goodbye. You saved me. What's going on here? A massacre. These armed thugs just appeared from nowhere. We need to get help. What the? I can make the call from the control room one floor up. Can you take me there? Sure. Keeps wanting to sit down. I don't know what the deal is with that. Okay. No, dual Berettas. That's that's the way to do it. Let's see if there's any way I can adjust this. Home free, this way. Oh yeah. No. Poor guy. Working on his day off of all things. All right, let's just see what happens here. Come back. Come back. I just changed something with the video, so of course, now it's going to be all, come on, so absent, come back, yeah, it's on PS4 for a whole $14, <laughs> it's ridiculous, what the, come on, What is going on here? Alright, I'm gonna have to, uh... Oh god, hopefully this won't restart the game. But we're gonna disconnect for a second and come back. Oh, if we have to restart, that'll be a shame. But... Oh, okay, okay. So the game is back on my end. Hello. Where is it? Here, what... What's going on? Yeah, any any minute now, game. Feel free. Maybe if I close out of there, come back. Thank you, Alex Reg. Appreciate that. Uh, but it's not running. Don't you see? Don't you see? Come on. What in the... <laughs> okay, <laughs> I don't know what happened here. I think I'm going to have to uh, cut the stream and then restart it because uh, we seem to be having some weird issues here. So Wait a second, wait a second. Boom. Never mind. We're back. What was that about? Okay, hopefully that won't happen again. That was really weird. Max Payne never dies. it up. The train lit up like a Christmas tree. Power is back on. Sure is, Max. Let's hop aboard that choo-choo and get out of here. Oh. What's odd, Florence?
You know, Max can't really walk in a straight line. What? 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 What are you saying? This is. This game is amazing. He's a hard-boiled cop with nothing to lose. One man against all the scum of the underbelly of New York City. So much for being subtle. Oh my god. Uh, there we go. PlayStation controller, guys. It's gonna take some getting used to for this. It's also in easy mode because apparently you have to unlock hard boiled. I didn't realize that. The rusty door led to an abandoned part of the station, closed off since the early 40s. Something big was going down at Roscoe Street. Maybe that's why Alex had wanted to meet me here. Maybe not. One way or the other. I was gonna find out. That's right, Max. His options are reduced to a singular course. Revenge. Thank you. She ain't asking for me. Take it easy. It's, get this, jump is R2. What the hell? How is that just like a, a natural God, choice? Spooky. Jack Lapino, yeah, spooky. But also it's like, whack! Ah! Ah! Oh. But also it's like, whack! All right, I should probably... Not waste. Shotgun shells on opening an empty crate. Nothing. Okay. And that's what you say. What the hell? What the hell was that? Yeah, the baddies have some of the best dialogue. to listen to him but like I said you can't really walk in a straight line it's you can't really sneak up on people in this game whack them oh how about that oh shit Ooh. 50 caliber just blows them away Wait until we start the second one. That one has the ragdoll physics, and it is a hoot. <laughs> I love it. The police are on their way. New York's finest. They're gonna be. Oops. Oh no, we're good. Oh Jesus. The rambling good time we're having. Oh, oh shit! I did not expect him to get the jump, drop him like that. But he did. Yeah, you know the controls in this game aren't really the best. So it's a little clunky, but you know, it's got charm and character. And that's what keeps me coming back, really. We come to you now, 
Mike from the crime scene. Who is this? Right back at you. This is Deputy Chief Jim Bravora from the NYPD. You are to cease your criminal activities and surrender immediately. Sure thing, Jim. Me and the boys have been talking and everyone's real sorry. He'll never do it again. Who the hell is this? Being placed at the scene of a bank robbery wouldn't have tipped the odds in my favor. Oh, Max. A renegade cop with nothing to lose. He's just digging himself cool, deeper into the hole. Oh, yeah, over here. So my plan tonight is to get all the way up... Oh, I should have listened to that. Is to get all the way up to the first dream sequence and... And probably play that one on my own time because these fucking dreams are the worst. Just, like, maddening how, how bad of a design they are. So... <laughs> I don't, I don't really want to do that on stream. I'd rather just muscle through it and then pick up the right after. Explosives to send Lady Liberty to orbit. It's fucking terrible. All right, we got the explosives. Let's put them to use. Get some more Beretta ammo and let's go. No. It's not my first one. You, you can, if you look at my page, you can see all my past ones. But, uh... I, I don't know what, what, what number this one is. Probably... Maybe in total, number 10? Maybe less? I, I, I really don't know. But... Early in the stages of, of streaming. Very early. What shortcuts can you possibly take during the dreams? <laughs> it's a maze. I, uh, I don't even want to talk about it. I hate it. This is Lupino's game? This is Lupino's doing? Lupino's men? Really? Oh, if it's Jack Lupino, then it's... Can you get through? No, it's locked. We gotta get out of here. If it's Lupino, it's... Alex? This, this theme. There was nothing I could do. God. He was dead. I could tell by the empty accused. Hordes of nostalgia. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. The fuzz. Oh shit. I am all. Oops. I came here to chew bubble gum and shoot my Beretta. Let's go. That's right, fucking bullet time. Alex had kept me relatively sane for the past three But it, it's the pills that now help him. I how I felt. Somehow he had stumbled upon something big and ended up stepping on Jack Lupino's toes. As much as I, you know, tend to dislike the third game, I do love the fact that it finally addresses the fact that he's a pill addict and, and a drunk and <laughs> he just has zero control over anything in his life. Except bullet time. It's the only thing he can control. The NYPD was closing in. I could hear the sirens. Their wail was a crescendo. Lupino thought he could get us by taking Alex out and leaving me to take the fall for it. All he had gotten was my attention. Well, I've been playing the uh, a couple of Resident Evil games. I'm going to go back to that series after this. Gonna play Anamusha, The Suffering. You know, mainly retro games. 
It's kombucha. Um, what other games will I play? Um, sheesh. Uh, you know, I mean, that's that's probably it. I don't know what else I would honestly play. No, no one has suggested anything. It's the Finito Brothers. It's not Naked Juice. Outlast? No, I don't like Outlast. Oh, you're drinking Naked. Okay, okay. Light up the Finito Brothers. Well, you know, one person keeps telling me to play a certain game, and, you know, I just, God, I, I don't know if I'm going to commit to it. I need some, you know, some, uh, some extra, extra encouragement to play the particular game, but... In the meantime, I got my list. Always falling short, taking his frustration out on underage addicts and call girls. The V vehicle is down at your hotel. That's exact word. Quote, Vinny, you're in charge of this one. Unquote. We go on Wednesdays, coming to see you through. Anything goes wrong, it is. It's it's a coded language. Treat this guy real good. Anything he wants, you give him. Don't screw this up, will you, Finito, Finitos? The Finito Brothers. Locked doors, lots of nervous thugs with itchy trigger fingers. I'd seen nothing coming in, but that didn't mean it hadn't been there. Rico Muerte was a regular Kaiser Sosa. A spook story told to keep the apes in line. Rico Muerte. The Finitos had scribbled Muerte's room number on the note's margin. Uh-oh. Joey, Virgilio. All right, here we go. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love when a plan works out. It's nice. Look at this guy. He landed on the couch and the table. Place to be. Oh, that was that was satisfying. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, would anyone watch me play? Um, uh, what's it called? Has anyone heard of? Um, I think it's Red Dead. Red Dead. Is that a? That's a game, right? relatively new am I saying that right red dead blast through that glass I'm not gonna listen to the radio I'm sorry we're gonna skip it have you heard of red dead watch this nice red oh red dead redemption yeah I guess um, there's a couple of them, but uh, if anyone wants me to, wants to see me play one of them, I guess the second one, whatever, maybe. Never heard of them. Always them to be a cowboy. Uh, no YouTube page, but I'm on the. I got half a billion views on Pornhub, so that's something. <laughs> that's something, I guess. Look at this guy. What is he doing? Ba-da-ba-da-ba-da-ba-da. 
if if someone uh, well you know it is my birthday on uh, Saturday so if someone were to let's just say hypothetically gift me Red Dead Redemption 2 I would definitely play it in a cowboy get up alright now everyone be quiet because this is my favorite show oh fuck no oh I love the TV shows in Max Payne. Okay. Why am I just behind that? Now let's watch the show, everyone. Holy hell. They can't put that on TV. What's the world coming to? Oh, shit. Well, thanks for letting me know that you're watching it for free. You know, we work really hard for that content. No pun intended. But it is so much more supportive if you subscribe to, uh, you know, our OnlyFans, or even subscribe to my, uh, oh god, my many vids, or you know, my personal P Hub channel. Yeah, like, like Florence. Come on, that's no excuse. Don't make excuses for it. Maybe he just wanted to talk to me, and I was very trader happy. Whoa! All I'm saying is, think about it. You know, just just consider it. Consider what you're doing when you when you watch pirated videos. You know, just consider it for a second. Hey, you gotta pay to play. As Max Hollywood would say, you gotta pay before you pump. It's like a gas station. But we're, you know, we work very hard, and unfortunately, the content gets ripped away from us almost immediately, and then we don't see a dime. So. You know, in these trying times, could you can you spare spare a buck? Help! Help! Oh my goodness! Help us out! Oh my goodness! God, Max is quick on the draw. Yeah, it's a great podcast. I uh, I second that. John Ronson. Butterfly effect. Very good. Lena Misivitz. Ooh. Poor gay. He must have got ripped on... What is it? Valkyr? Valkyr? Valkyr, that's the drug. Well, this isn't the place for it. So if you want to see that... Subscribe to my OnlyFans. You understand? This is not the area for anything lewd or sexual. There are certain... There are correct avenues for that, okay? This is something completely different. Yeah, buy a book. What the hell? Christmas is coming up. Who doesn't like a good, a good uh, steamy memoir? All right, shit's about to get real. Oh my god! I 
Tom Muerte's room. Here it is. It's rigged. Muerte had received a letter. Let's see what it says. Um, Our investigation had turned up. Florence, there is an audio book. What are you talking about? The head of the Blanchinella family to Valkyr. Um, here's a hug for Greninja. I don't know. I don't know what you want me to do. I don't, I don't know what you're asking for. Happy birthday. How about that? It's not his birthday. What am I talking about? Just what up? No, Florence. Not with me, Raging. But, you know, yeah, maybe maybe the next one I'll, I'll do the audio book. We'll see. Collecting evidence had gotten old a few hundred books. We'll see, back. Florence. Maybe I'll just do it for you. So far past the point of no return, I couldn't even remember what it looked like when I had passed it. Bum, 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 bum. Rico Muerte. Oh, Florence, you would do it? That'd be sick. I would love that. I would, I would definitely love the idea of, of you, or, you know, someone like you if you weren't <laughs> totally interested in doing the audiobook instead of, uh, you know, the usual uh, male voice actor, or myself. Bump, bump. Oh, bye bye. Thanks for subscribing. See you later. Oh, out of this ledge. It's cold out here. I didn't want to know what had happened here. It was not a pretty sight. Yeah, right. Buff. Sky Vampire. Ooh, do not fall. You know what I should do? Uh... How the... Wait a second. What? Um... Never mind. I, I was trying to quick save. I, I guess you can't quick save on easy mode? What the hell is that about? Whew. Spooked me. What the? Tomorrow, probably not. I thought it was about for sure. Now this will probably be my only one this week. <sighs> Slow motion drop. That's what's up. Oh wait, where the? They weren't even looking at it. Oh. The hooker had left her diary on the table. Oh my gosh, it's a hooker. The diary belonged to a hooker named Candy Dawn. The reader had made a vice cop blush. Had talks with the mystery hag over the phone again. Sent to the latest one-eyed Alfred tape. As long as the hag keeps paying for the tapes, the old man could come every day for all I care. She had a nice sideline, making secret X-rated flicks of her clients and selling them to the highest bidder. They would get her killed if her V-fix for the day didn't do it first. OT Max. Oh, hidden camera. Just right here. Okay, what, what kind of angle do they have here? Nice. Whoa. Yeah, good horror films. Um, I was talking about this the other day. Host on Shudder. 
It's a it's a quarantine quarantine themed movie. I don't know. Let's call it that. It was conceived, uh, shot, and released all during during COVID. So the whole movie takes place over Zoom. It's a uh, you know a seance gone awry. Really Old effective. Really spooky. Down to the bowels of Jack Lupino's hotel. Um, Invisible Man. That's pretty good. Saw that recently. No, I didn't watch Bly Manor yet. That's on my list. Uh, I was going to start it last night, but instead I uh, started Pen Fifteen. I was in the mood for something a little, uh, a little lighter. So I'll get to Bly Manor eventually. What the? Skip the TV. Nice. Yeah, I saw Tuscan Theaters opening night. Uh, not that that's really a brag or anything. I did not like that movie. I don't like Kevin Smith. Uh, <laughs> I don't. I don't think it was my choice to see it, but. I guess of all Kevin Smith's movies, um, it's not my least favorite, so there's that. Uh. Oh, come on. They're all empty. God, I'm so mad. I'm just gonna break all these fucking crates. Nothing in that either. Yeah, it's a weird one. I mean, I'll, I'll definitely give it points for, for being weird and, and <laughs> pretty original and really just, just going for it. Yeah, now there's something to be said for really, really committing to the bit. Captain Baseball, that boy, has an unbeatable track record in superhero death matches. <laughs> but a six pack of root beer gets me every time. The murder weapon was a baseball bat, now lying in a pool of drying blood next to a newspaper folded open on a Captain Baseball bat boy comic strip. Captain Favorite. Baseball bat boy comic strip. The calling card of Frankie the Bat. We'll meet him later. Another day. Why they always set in LA or Mexico? They can't even get a tan. If I was a blood suck, I'd move to the North Pole. Two rounds. That's it. Tell you one thing that's really great to watch. Uh, instead of having to sit through, you know, the entirety of a horror film because, like, you know, sometimes you just don't really want to watch the Kill Count on YouTube. Hosted by James A. Janice, one of my favorite favorite shows to watch. Uh, it's it's funny. It, you get an in depth look at a lot of horror movies that. Yeah, maybe you haven't seen. And then you get your fix of of uh, of horror and death and murder. Gentlemen, let's do business. Boom boom. We don't need any more drugs on our streets. There's a key on the table. 
Yeah, Enter the Matrix, yeah, had had the same exact effect. Although, in that one, you could, like, <laughs> do, like, corkscrews as you dive, or, uh, run up the wall and stuff. That game was alright. Alright, here we go. First, I guess, you know, technically a boss fight. I'll call it a mini boss, but, you know, it's pretty much a boss fight. Let's get fully healed, why not? It's a great cutscene. Like 12 year old me watching this cutscene. <laughs> I don't know what the hell was going on. Oh my god. Easy mode is a joke. I cannot believe I already killed him. It's just poor Candy Dawn. And look at this. Rico has his pants down. Oh my god. Got him. Hey, tell you what, if you want to suggest uh, videos like that, don't come here. There are proper channels for that, you know? And don't tell me you're not looking for porn, because I know you are. There was an old telephone switchboard in the back room of the reception area. Kind of made phone tapping child's play. It wasn't hard to picture a fat pimp sweating with headphones on, listening to his hookers talk dirty and fake orgasms over a web of party lines, the blood veins of New York. Right now, there was a different set of Mon Monroe going on. Exactly, man. Knock it off with this. You're not fooling anyone. Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? released into the city's corrupt circulatory system. Something wicked this way comes. Max Payne at large. Let's go, let's go. Pretty much, you just run into every room, guns blazing. Well, here's the deal. Take the hint. I told you the first time, don't come here asking for that stuff. You did it again. You do it one more time, I'm gonna block you. That's that's the, the way it is. Yo, 
let's get to Ingram. Let's do it. Just like that. It's, oh my god, it's ridiculous how easy this is on easy mode. I, I wish they didn't force you to do it first time around. You're not this way? Which way, then? Oh, that's right. I have to unlock the door. Mobster, bookies, and loan now, sharks. Now, it was a mystery to me, but they knew I was a cop. They knew I was coming, and they were going to get real trigger happy about it. I got to see Lupino's hangout all lit up. A bomb went off, turned snow into liquid gold. A pillar of fire lifted the remains of the car straight up into the air. The flames were highlighted on the hood of a black Mercedes Benz as it coasted down the street real slow. And who's behind the wheel of that car? Shotgun. It was Vladimir, the head of the local Russian mob, the fly in Don Punchinello's suit. Yeah, I said, if you want any of that the stuff, subscribe and contact me place. there. The appropriate place. Not here. Volka. Get to him before the fuzz arrives. Come on. At least it used to be before the explosive makeover. Mm, forget about the pawn shop. The headlines were a depressing read. All right, we'll check them out. I like these headlines. screaming bloody murder. The storm was a screaming duet with the approaching prowl car sirens. It was all a scream. It was all a scream. Who wanted for murder. It's a scream, baby. And let's face it, Sid. You gotta have a sequel, baby. Set these junkies. The whole building was rigged with explosives. Oh, fire behind me. Face it, Sid. Your mom was no Sharon Stone. Grenade. Oh, really? Only him? I guess I assumed there'd be more guys there. Oh. 
microphone. Is it Chief Bravura? Let's find out. There we go. God. Oh, it isn't Chief. just a junkie in need of a fix, but it turned out to be something more sinister than that. Am I speaking to Mr. Payne? Who wants to know? My name is Alfred Wooten. You must hurry. The police are on their way. Tell me something I don't know. They know you're there. How? And what's it to you? <laughs> I will contact you. How do you think, Max? You're shooting up the whole city. The cops arrived. Sirens singing in the off key harmony of the mannequin press of choir. I had a few minutes while the SWAT team would go through their usual routine. By the time they busted in, I needed to be long gone. Max Payne, this is Deputy Chief Jim Rivera from the NYPD. Drop your weapons and come out with your hands above your head. Sister Morin? What's that? Oh my god. Oh my god, he's there? Ooh. Man, this game really lags when there's too much stuff going on at once. I could not believe that. Someone has left a Explosion. While in bullet time. While killing someone else. The whole game comes to like a screeching halt. All guts and no butts. There's no freaking way he has the guts to try anything after that. As it turned out, the Russian had plenty of guts. One thing he could count oh, on. Oh, Maureen. Maureen Prescott. Back. They're on the counter. She was flashing her shit all over town, like she was Sharon Stone. There's a key on the shelf. I do believe I will take that. And we have to go in this oversized door. Look at this thing. <laughs> Dwarf Max. No more kombucha. Ah, it's a sad thing. Yep. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Anyone's bathroom? What about this one? No. Oh. Whew. God. Sometimes when you have to jump those gaps, the only thing you can do is go into bullet time, and it's. He, he jumps so low to the ground, it's like it feels like he'll never make it. Whoa! Anyway, for fans of Scream, once again, I, I gotta recommend watching the kill count. Channel is dead meat. Kill count. Trust me, you will not be disappointed. Uh, also, jump R2? What were they thinking? It's the weirdest thing. The bombs have destroyed all the stairs up to Lupino's office. By way of adjoining rooftops. All right, so we'll just save. But no auto save. I think that's. I mean, no quick save. I think that's bizarre. It's never been this cold. Never, ever. ever. It's, it's like, like the sky is falling. falling. It's the end of the world, all right. Okay. Forget about that. <laughs> I don't feel fine. Poor little rat. To get to the roof, I 
need to get to the elevator through the locked door up ahead. Pizza delivery. Pizza delivery. Never seen you before. Buzz, Buzz off, Joker. Alright. Guess I have to get creative. Find a way in this joint, huh? Oh. Are these stairs out? Nope. Oh, yes, they are. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay, looks like this is our only option. Let's go, let's go. Alright. Stay close behind, buddy. Wrong place for that, pal. Do it again, and I I gotta say, I'm gonna have to block you. You can't come here talking like that. Dude, there he is. John Who? Oh, oh, they're all dead. Damn. So much for the theatrics. Oh, that cut was pretty theatrical. What was that roll? Pretty great elevator music for this shithole. Oh no, get him, get him, get him! Oh. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, we're gonna skip the TV. Hopefully, I won't fall off this railing. Ooh, I mean, these pipes. Can't even get through. What the hell? Hey, hey. But that's where I always end up anyway. Only, it's not me talking to the pen flamingo, but someone who looks the part down to the finest detail. Except that he's evil. I'm he's evil. The shadows, watching it all unfold. The whistle was from the, the game. Speaks. We can speak here. It says... Alright, let's we'll skip it. Parts Unknown is pretty cool. Or Address Unknown, I mean. But Parts Unknown is also a great show. Alright, 
but my doppelganger. I guess I have to hit the door first. Oh no. Stuck behind the wall. Okay, now this starts the uh, the much maligned chase scene into the. I guess I don't. It's hard to determine what's really a boss fight. I guess this is boss fight. Benny got needy. Just the man I've been killing to see. Hey, I I guess so. We'll no we'll call it a boss fight. Freaking job. You can't just come in here waving your piece like it meant something. Oh, you freaking shot me. Yeah. Oh, my God. You're the oh, fucking cop. Ah. You're dead, Pete. What the hell are you waiting for, you ain't? Kill him. Kill him. Where's your boss? I was dragging you to hell. He's good. I made my cherry on fat. God, me, he's great. He's, he's hilarious. And just like that. Now hopefully I don't die on this so chase scene. It's, it's easy to mess up. Never had the nerve to finish With the wonky controls, you know. Just the other night, he shot Dino because he wanted to see what his brain looked like splattered on the wall. He's a freaking mad dog. We're running out of men. and business fast. Got me had been living in mortal fear of his boss. Jack Lupino was a psycho. Yeah, it's hard to really... Quantify it as a boss fight because it's not that hard. But yeah, you're right. Like important people, <laughs> named characters. How about that? Broken bottle of Tabasco. That's great. All right, don't fall off the pipe. Oh my fucking god! What did I say? I knew I would do that. Because he can't walk a straight line. He's always I was moving like this. <laughs> what a joke of all of all things. <sighs> Tell me I start right when the chase began. Okay. Whatever. Oh my god. You killed your own goon pal. Okay. Forget the letter, let's just go and not make the same mistake again. He could run with a bullet in his stomach like a broken bottle of Tabasco. He was quickly running out of time. He knew where his boss was, and I wanted to square things up with Jack Lupino. Got needy would be moving fast. I don't know about angels. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god, you are <laughs> Woo. so Oh my god, it's like the razor's edge. Oh my god. Okay, well, we made it across that one. Whoops. So we're safe for now. Okay, see you later. Thanks for stopping by. This one, too. This jump is ridiculous. Oh, I've messed this up so many times. Just go ahead. Let's just jump on this moving train. Let's just do it. Oh, <laughs> oh man. It is just a, a wonky design. This was 
was my second train ride of the night. The way it started didn't promise anything better than the last one. Freezing wind tearing at my face like sand dirt burn razors. Ice hard and slick under my hands and feet. And somewhere in the background, the wail of sirens. Right about that. City howling after me. Bow, bow, bow. New York sped by and fast forward. Dark rooftop water towers and a dead forest of antennas and chimneys, all a blur. When the train he was riding slowed down, Carnegie made his move. And then I made mine. Look at that. God. So limber, so agile. All right, Max, let's see what you got. Man, he stuck that landing. Oh, I think Gagnini just pinched his hand in his time. Okay, okay. More pipes, more pipes, let's not, and this is why the dream sequence is so hard, because you, you really, you gotta walk a straight line, and Max just can't do it. Okay. He <laughs> just cannot walk a straight line, I can't believe it. Yikes, okay. Now where's this jump across, is this... Oh my goodness. My god, he's like a stormtrooper. Can't get anything. Now you can't attack this helicopter until it presumably goes down, but... trouble with the, with the cops, you know. Alright, boss, don't worry, we'll die for you. Just like you would for us, right? Right, boss? Did this read a one up. I got so lucky. Look at these shots I missed. What do you got? Beretta ammo. I'll take it. Never underestimate the power of dual wielding Berettas. It's not his hand? Oh. Gotta follow the trail of blood. We'll get to him. You know what would be a good ASMR? I don't know if I've... I, I, I've never seen it or listened to it for that matter, but like neck cracking and back cracking and stuff. That's satisfying. I, I love to see videos of uh, chiropractors just really... Whew, really doing a number on someone's spine, you know? Ah. Oh, that was the last of my ammo. His teeth. Oh, you freaking chap! Oh, you shot me! Yo. Oh, where's that? 
Someone else is out here. But where? Killed. Okay, that's this is a waste of slow motion. This guy's ready for me. Oh. What the? Oh no. Woo. Oh boy. Yeah, he, he hurt me there. Jeez. Man, he got so lucky with that grenade. Give me those painkillers. Daddy needs his pills. Freaking rich! Freaking, freaking rich! Well, sorry to say, fellas, but at least you went out in a really suggestive position. Yeah. I use Beretta ammo to acquire more Beretta ammo. It's symbiotic, no? Nope. Yep. Valkyr, Valkyr, Valkyr. Damn, they really like that drug. Okay, skipping. Play, play. What is it not? Is it not playing for you? Looks, looks pretty good on my end. You know, all things considered. My God, nope. Oh, it still hurt me. God, it is. It's so nice to just throw on that bullet time and run around. I prefer that over the diving, honestly. I don't know why. It just is, feels a little more satisfying. Because the diving, you only have like two seconds to really pick a spot and then unload. Oh my god, stop with these grenades. Fuck these grenades. No one else? Huh. Boy, I thought I got shot in the back. No, Frankie the Bats is uh, later. But we won't get that far tonight. We'll get right... We'll get to the dream sequence right before that part. And uh... Then we're gonna cut it quits. Call it quits. Cut the feed. Oh. oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right, you're right. You does say that. You play, you pay, you bastard. Oh.
Yet he's still alive. Barely, barely grazed him. It's the flesh wound. Gagnetti ran out of steam in a dead end alley with steam boiling out of the sewer grates like all the fires of hell were burning high beneath us. It was shake down time. It's a mouthful. It was shake down time. After I unloaded about a hundred rounds into him, I decided then I would interrogate him. I rate pretty high on that. You, 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 you can't be spurting in cold blood. Uh, just keep telling yourself that. <gasps> Listen good, Candyman. I'm not going to be anybody's fall guy. I want to know where your boss is hiding. Listen good, Candyman. There was no glory in this. I hadn't asked for this crap. Trouble had come for me in big, dark swarms. The good and the just were like gold dust in the city. I had no illusions. I was no you freaking chap! No Book me! Call me to the station. Just don't hurt me no more. Your rights will be read at your funeral. I'll tell you, I'll tell you, just don't hurt me no more. Lupino's at Ragnar Ross, the nightclub. Book me. Take me in a home in the freaking jail. Just don't hurt me. Your rights will be read at your funeral. Whoops. Peace. We're not, we're not, we're not gonna play the dream. <laughs> I'm gonna play that on my own time, just to get it over with. But yeah, I'll probably <clears throat> stream again. Oh, I don't know. Probably next week, to be honest. Monday, maybe. We'll see. Ragnarok was as inviting as a headache, flickering and flashing to a machine gun beat. The belly of the nightclub was a gothic theme park that began with bondage games and led to the nasty stuff from there. As subtle with its dark messages, a cop killer bullet through the heart. Like father, like son. Just like Jack Lupino. Like father, like son. Alright. Hopefully I'll be able to breeze right through this. This leads to a definitive boss fight. Like, there's no denying that Jack Lupino's a boss. Come on, come on. Sorry, pal. Oh! Might have to drop on me there. The book could never been a bestseller. Okay, I will pick up the book just for context. setting I was surprised to find that somebody had been passing time reading. The paperback was entitled The Age of Murder and Storm. The blurb on the back mentioned Norse mythos and Ragnarok. The book had the end never of been a bestseller. The terrible winter that covered the earth and ice when vile crimes were rampant and all of humanity lost. I could see how somebody impressionable might get it into their head that we were at the end of time. I was also beginning to see what the nightclub and its owner were all about. He's into the occult. He's a psycho voodoo bastard. Woo! Whoa! Where did that grenade come from? Oh my god. Who's throwing Molotovs? This is J.O. Took care of him. Look, Max can uh, dance in the flames. It's pretty fun. What? Oh. Let's get out of here. Stop horsing around. Oh, another dance hall. The moves. Oh shit. I still got the moves. Oh, so the occult had been piled up. 
more occult paraphernalia? What is going on in this place? The room was stacked with light reading, such as Necronomicon, Witchcraft, and Paradise Lost. Old exotic titles like Malleus Malfacarum and Day Umbrarum Rainy Novum Portis. Books with pentagrams on their covers, all dealing with the occult and the infernal. Flying between stacks of horror videos and a couple of Ouija boards. The only thing I could take seriously was the thought of Lupino taking it okay. seriously. He'd been spending a lot of time getting intimate with the guy downstairs. I'm all whacked out on Valkyr. The guy is bad news. He's bad news, but we're going to take care of him. He wants to meet the devil? Well, we'll give him what he wants. What would he know in all? I wouldn't say anything to his face. He might not. But who knows what he's doing? Yeah, but somebody's got to go in there. Again, these goons. <laughs> Friendly fire up the wazoo. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Trying to... Wow. My... My game is lagging on the console. It must look terrible on the stream, but... Door activated. See ya. Come on, change your position, buddy. Come get me. Come on. Can't say the AI is really. Great. Oh. oh. Oh my god. These assholes with the Ingrams, they are... Man, they, they can really drain your health. Don't like them. Okay, here's another... Another spot... That I, I really wish I could quick save, because... If I fall off of this, I don't know where it's gonna start me from. This shit is the fucking worst. Really just have to inch across, all right? Oh my god. Okay, like we're in a room with a liquor and we're trying not to disturb it. Ooh! Well, what the fuck? This is bullshit. It's almost like, oh! Oh my god. Like they never even like test played these parts. Because there are, oh my god, they're like rage quit inducing. Okay, got that over with. And now there's another one. Woohoo, two in a row. This is, oh man, this will test your patience. not even fun you know like it's just bad design but what's great design is max's haircut he's got that flat top <laughs> look at this he's got a perfectly square head
Hi, bitch. Nah, that's a nice shot. I like that. The cinematics in this are pretty cool. I, I really enjoy them. Stuck in the walls. Man. It's funny though, like when this game came out, I mean, I remember it being cutting edge. I mean, the bullet time for sure, but like everything else, I was like, whoa, it is just the, the best of the best. But now it's just, you know, retrospectively pretty funny. Oh shit! Oh my god, I just lit this guy on fire. I had never done that before. I didn't even know you could do that. Oh, whoops, whoops, oh! Double whoops, I didn't mean to take that painkiller. Let's see, is that Grammy access? Sure do. Hey. <laughs> I love it. It's like I just blasted him in the chest with a shotgun. And he's just gonna run away. All right, another one of these dreadful, just oh my god, so so awful. So, so off. Oh my god. <laughs> Why does he keep going to the left? I mean, t whoa! Really? <sighs> yeah, that's, that's anxiety inducing. I don't like it. Here we are. We're nearing the end of this. The backstage area led to Lupino's inner sanctum. The hot air inside is like an invisible wall, thick with incense and something else. A sickly sweet smell that made you gag. Do you just call this it his inner rectum? Big Apple. Lupino lurked somewhere ahead, like a spider at the center of his web, waiting. The papers in the air started to make my head swim. Mm. Torn pieces of a letter lay scattered on the sofa. Too much incense. Where's the sofa? There it is. Get him, Max. Incense is overwhelming. Punchinello had threatened Lupino in writing. The note had been torn to pieces, bloody fingerprints all over it. Don't want you to think that one of my boys is not playing with a full deck. Shape up, Jack. We are running a business here. I hate to send the trio to strong on you. The trio were the Don's notorious henchmen. It was obvious that Lupino hadn't been intimidated by the threat. Uh, Lupino is. He is gone a wall. The flesh of fallen angels! Come to me all! Blood to you all! Alright, let's see how far we can with the Berettas. Words! I'm beyond words! That sound means time to fight. Oh, 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 my God. These trench coat assholes. Like, miniature Mr. X is running around. Where, where is this guy shooting from? Don't even see him. Oh, oh, what the? Oh! You okay, pal? Show yourself so I can kill you. I 
hands to our side. Come on, open the curtains. Show yourself, buddy. What, are you afraid of a cop? Come on. Just a lousy cop. Here it is. Look at him. Dude's a freaking psycho. in it somewhere and this one was the empire state building of catches rubino just pumped up and died to go 15 rounds with a mutant alligator and then he started this spooky monkey talk straight from a bad dream mine i have tasted the flesh of fallen angels i've tasted the devil's green blood it runs in my veins i've seen beyond the world of skin the architecture of blood and bow and arrow. Death is coming. <laughs> she is coming. And hell follows with oh God. This is the twilight winter. I am ready to be her son. <laughs> her time is now. And all who stand in her way must die. <laughs> You'll die! You'll die! Now! Oh, oh, he just threw a... Oh, we got him. And I... Son of a bitch! Oh my god, I thought it would cancel that out, but yeah, he... I don't know what's happening. We both died, but this... Okay, I guess I didn't die. Mona Sachs? That girl is dangerous. The backstage area led to Lupino. Are you kidding me? Them. The hot air inside was like an invisible I, wall. Oh my god. The game must have gotten confused because this was the rotten core it registered that I won the and registered that I died at the same like time. So I guess, web, waiting. I guess I died. Um... Torn pieces of a letter lay scattered on the sofa. That's the ridiculous. I can't, I can't believe that happened. Alright, let's do it again. Blood to you all! Can I skip this? Oops. Ah, oh man, I'm so disappointed that happened. All it took was one Molotov. I am the wolf, yeah! I am the wolf! Okay, let's try it again. Uh huh. You will be witness to the end. I will rise to her side! Only words and beyond words! Oh, nope. Yo was right. What the? Are you shooting me from behind the curtain? Come on. 
What are you afraid of? Just a lousy cop. Ready for the fight again? Oh. Okay, let's. Oh. Mm. Like cockroaches, come on. God, I wish I could. Well, I guess I could skip this. Don't die, don't die. No, 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 Jack. No, no, I won't. No, no, don't, no, don't die. That's, that's the plan. The plan is to not die. Okay. Didn't die. Stay that way. He was a bad monster. Turned them into friggin' zombie demons from outer space. I think, I think he's, he's dead, dead already. Huh? And that's when it happened. But dead or not, you've got the wrong guy. In stepped this knockout femme fatale holding a gun to my face. I returned the favor. It's a cold day. Lisa Punchinello was the Don's wife. Lisa Punchinello? Lisa's evil twin. Your safety's off, evil twin. You might hurt someone with that gun of yours. <laughs> yeah. She's the damsel in distress. No joke. I'm a professional. I'd blow you away without batting an eye. Sure. And you can check out my credentials splattered all over this joint. Jack couldn't so have cute when they flirt. not the state he was in. We're after the same slime bag. Angela Quincinello's the one who murdered your friend, framed you with it. You know this for a fact. I've got my sources. I don't have a clue these days. I just shoot them as they come. Who put a contract on the Archfiend? This one's mine. I hate the guts of that sadistic wife beater. Why not pool our bullets for this one? I thought you'd never ask. My finger was starting to twitch. How do you like your whiskey? Try to slip me a Mickey. You're a real angel, Max. <laughs> Too late. Stuff, Tasted sweet as honey going down. Nothing personal. Can't risk you going berserk and getting Lisa killed. She drugged him. Can you believe that? The nightmare was always the same. Violent shirts, right. darkness, old and ugly. The killer's mad laughter was a riddle filled with wicked innuendo. This is where we're gonna cut this short because I am not gonna play this sequence. On stream somewhere the baby was crying but uh we'll pick this up i don't know i assume in exactly one no no no, not, not a week monday but it could be sooner we'll see anyway thanks for watching and uh until next time